A man charged in connection with one of the most notorious cold cases in the state in history is expected to go on trial early next month. The trial will begin the week of February 5th. He is accused of kidnapping and murdering four-year-old Jessica Gutierrez in 1986. McDowell, who's now 63 years old, was arrested in 2022. Jessica's body has not been found. Today, he remains at the Lexington County Detention Center on charges of murder, kidnapping, first-degree burglary, and failure to register as a sex offender. Ashley Jones spoke with Jessica's mother today, and Ashley, understandably, this is an extremely difficult process for her. Debbie Gutierrez did not want to go on camera today. She says she's still mentally trying to prepare herself to face the man who's accused of snatching her daughter's life away nearly four decades ago. Everybody has a sad, tragic story. I don't even have a grave to visit. Following Thomas McDowell's arrest in 2022, Debbie Gutierrez returned to the home where she was living the night her four-year-old daughter Jessica was kidnapped in Lexington County. Her reaction captured on camera by the Sheriff's Department. This is where I love my children with my whole heart and soul. This is where I struggle to have them in a home, love them, take care of them, protect them. Home is where your heart is, but if you're not safe at home, where are you going to be safe at? Investigators say little Jessica was snatched out of her bed in the summer of June 1986. For decades, investigators had no information or evidence pointing to what happened to Jessica. But in 2021, through DNA evidence, a fingerprint to be exact, Lexington County Sheriff's Department sled and the FBI named now 63-year-old Thomas McDowell as a suspect. More than 3,500 case files were reviewed by authorities before McDowell's arrest. WIS obtained copies of McDowell's arrest warrants. It states he confessed to kidnapping and murdering Jessica to people in the Lexington community. He lived in the same neighborhood as Jessica, but was arrested at a home in Wake Forest, North Carolina. Here he is during his bond hearing. Gutierrez was there when a judge denied McDowell's bond. Somebody knows something. We need you people to step up because I'm going to tell you something. None of these tragedies discriminate. It was my family in 1986. It could be anybody's tomorrow. And this is an age progressed photo of Jessica. Investigators say this is how they believe she would have looked today. Again, her body has still not been found. Investigators are asking anyone with any information in Jessica's case to please reach out to Lexington County Sheriff's Department or submit a tip through Crime Stoppers.